So, uh, review muna tayo dun sa past lesson natin. So, we have here the uh, factorial notation. So, when we say factorial notation, so, define as the product of all positive integers from 1 to n. So, that is, uh, meron tayong n factorial. So, this is equal to uh, n times n minus 1 times n minus 2 hanggang uh, we have 3 times 2 times 1. So, that is the uh, factorial notation. And then, uh, meron din po tayong um, the number of, of permutations of object taken all a time is P permutation of n and then n. So, that is n factorial. Okay, so ito po yung example natin we have the uh, different from one another and then uh, all of the object are included in the arrangement okay parang ito yung walang ano uh, yung words na walang uh, kaparehas na letters okay and then so we have and then we have the sec uh, the third one we have the number of permutations of of n distinct object taking r at a time so we have fermentation of n object taking r at a time is equal to uh, we have the n factorial all over n minus r or minus o r factorial which is the n is the number of object and then the r is the number of object taking at a time Okay, so nagbigay din tayo ng example dyan last time. And then, uh, yung sumunod is uh, pag nagkaroon tayo ng repetition. Okay, so that is the arrangement with repetition o yung tinatawag na distinguishable uh, permutation. So we have the permutation of N and then these are the repeated wedding uh, letters. Okay, and then we have the formula N factorial all over uh, repeat, uh, repeated letters factorial and then hanggang kung ilan man po iyon okay so that is uh, yung ating topic last time so doon na tayo so next topic natin is this one eto na po so yung ating pangatlo na na ba? Yes. So, so ito yung ating uh, circular permutation. Okay? So, in circular permutation, so where the arrangement of different objects is in circular manner. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, parang uh, uh, dun sila nakapwesto, pabilog. Okay? So, ang difference na to, dun sa last uh, sa ating mga previous uh, permutation so uh, it does not have any first uh, or last position and then we have two formula so apat nga ito so ito po muna yung ating gagawin so if we have n is equal to r so if we have uh, n is equal to r uh, yung ating formula will be n minus 1 and then if we have n is not equal to r so we have here uh, permutation of a of n taking that r time all over r okay so ayusin silang po natin tong formula na to okay so let have some example okay yan example natin for circular permutation so we have here the problem so find the number of different ways that a group of students or uh different ways that a group of five students can be seated around a circular table with five chairs okay so ang n natin dito is five and then also we have the r as is also five so using the formula so we have n is five okay so meron din tayong r natin is uh, is also five so ito yung n is equal to r Okay, so, ang formula natin dito, we have n minus 1 factorial. So, substitute lang po natin. Okay, so, if we substitute this, so, we have 5 minus 1 
factorial. So, this is 4. So, 4 factorial. So, this is 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. Okay? So, we have so we have 24 ways. So, ayan. Okay? So, 24 ways that a group of 5 students can be seated in a circular uh, table with 5 chairs. Okay? So, set pa tayo ng example. Next example, we have how many ways can Rose, Jenny, Liza, Kyle, Maine, and Apple can join hands to form a ring? Okay, so get natin yung N. So bilangin lang natin sila. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So ang N natin is, so we have 6. So ayan. So again, we can use the formula. So we have uh, N minus 1 factorial. So substitute lang po natin. So, we have 6 minus 1 factorial. So, this is 5 factorial. So, 5 factorial. So, we have 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 and then times uh, 1. Okay. So, this is uh, 120 ways. Ayan. Okay. So, ayan po. Next example, we have in how many ways can you arrange six person on a circular table if there are only four seats so dito so set na natin yung n natin so ang n natin dito uh, meron tayong six and then also we have r so that is four okay so ito yung pangalawang formula uh, if n is not equal to r so that is yung formula natin is uh, uh, we have Fermentation of N, N object, taking R, all over R. So, this is, uh, we have N factorial all over uh, N minus R factorial all over R. So, ayan po. Yung formula po niya. Okay? So, substitute po natin. So, we have here 6 factorial all over 6 minus 4 factorial all over 4 so 4 po yung ating r okay so again so this is 6 factorial all over uh, 2 factorial okay nandyan pa rin po si 4 okay so ayusin po muna natin so this become uh, 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 Okay, so and then we have 2 times 1. So, cancel natin to. So, ang maiiwan ay C uh, 6 times 5 times 4 and then times 3. So, anong mangyayari kay 4? So, kuhin natin yung reciprocal po nito. So, okay, so this become uh, all over 1. So, times po natin 1 fourth. Okay, so ayan. So, if we multiply this, uh, ang ano ang 6 times 5 times 4 saka times 3 so that is we have 360 so this is 360 times uh, divided by 4 so we have uh, 90 so 90 ways we can arrange uh, the 6 person in circular table if there is only 4 seat available Okay, so ayan po. So sana may natutunan sa ating uh, topic for today. So mag-aaral pong mabuti.